studio is too big for the both of us, DJ. Grooves. The movie should be made by real birds. You moon penguins are just gonna write some loud, noisy dribble. If I wanted a bunch of picnics to dance around while on birdseed, ha, I'd visit my grandchildren. <laughs> nonsense, darling, nonsense. You Owl Express birds are just gonna record another boring train-related western. You've done so for the last ten years, darling. What? No, we haven't, you buffoon! Conductor, darling, this year we'll be winning the annual Bird Movie Award, as our new movie props will bring in the audiences. These shiny things fell from the sky. They will light our movie sets and fill them with glimmer. Yeah. Well, this time around, we're also spicing it up with our newest movie props. These hourglass thingies will be the grand jewel in our train heist western. What the what? You no good dirty picnics. You've copied our props. I would never, darling. Clearly, you're the one who took inspiration in my flashy new props. Oh, that does it. Get out of here with you. I've got a movie to record. Fine by me, darling. But we'll be the ones who win the annual Bird Movie Award. Mark my word. How well you do when you can't get into the reception. <laughs> oh, wait, uh, shutting the picnics inside the studio will force them to work harder. All right, time to go, Owls. Let's make our killer movie. Oh, and, uh, receptionist, can you please close off that vent already? I don't want the smell of penguin to come anywhere near my crew. Have you come to make another purchase? little chirper. They're recording right now, so no one's allowed in. They're only insured for bird staff. Letting you in would be a liability. Don't even think about sneaking inside. Don't tell anyone this, but before DJ Grooves became fascinated by movies, he actually ran a nightclub. I know. Crazy, right? Who would have thought?
janitors. Let's make this movie happen. Owls in position. Action!
magnificent, stunning. This trophy is everything I desire. On the shelf in my living room. Of course, this big trophy is just a plastic replica. The actual trophy is really tiny. Oh my, oh my, what is that I see? Is it true inner beauty? An innocent soul with a heart of gold? Oh no, it's just a little girl. Hello. Oh wait, you're not a penguin. <laughs> That's good. I could use some non-penguin company around here, as all my penguins are frankly terrible actors. Here's the biz. I need your help. I'm on a terrible losing streak, and I just have to win this next annual bird movie award. There's no doubt I absolutely must have you as the star. Here, let me take care of this. We need to give you a bird passport, darling. Step right over here. The most important part of a passport is the picture, darling. You have to look flashy and stunning. Step right over here. Let's take the pic. Okay, put on a smile and stand still, please. Don't move. Let's see how the picture turned out. Darling, you moved! The picture is ruined! How could you? We've got to fix this ugly mugshot up with some old-fashioned photo doctoring. Here, take these markers and turn yourself into the most stylish, fashionable young lady. Let's slide this picture into your passport, and here you go. One passport for you. Wonderful, darling. Oh, just wonderful. Meet me at the movie set tomorrow, and we'll make you a star. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Oh. You can't just jump in and fiddle with the annual Bird Movie Awards. That's fraud! Fraud! Hey, everyone! We've got a fraudster over here! Oh, where are my owl guards at? Oh, why are the owls so darn useless? Uh, all right, listen here, lass. You're in big trouble. If you're helping crooked DJ Grooves rig the awards, and I can't take you to jail, then you're got to help me even the score. That's right. You're got to be the star of my movies, too. Here, hold our newest prop. Practice showing it off and bring it to my movie set tomorrow. You got that? Don't be late. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
you have here. Sorry for the break and entering. I just really wanted to see what an alien spaceship is like. You know, I expected aliens to be more green and probably with a thirst for flesh. But I guess you aliens come in all shapes and sizes, huh? Hey, if you're looking to explore our planet, you'll need to understand it first. Otherwise, you won't know if you're stepping on grass or quicksand. Don't know how to identify relics? Fear not. Cook and Cade is here. I'll let you have this burger cushion relic for free. You can identify this relic at the podium. If you place them on the podium in the correct order, you might be able to make sense of it. If you're able to identify a relic, something great might happen. You never know, so keep an eye out for relics. I've taught you everything I know about relics.
Based on giant geyser. You ask if we tell, you try to build base by not. <laughs> Son, you punch people when big and strong. But Mafia no son never become big and strong. Mafia heart is broken.
Folks around city belong to Mafia. No touch. <laughs> mafia joking. Child can't open vault. Vault secure with code. Wait, Mafia code not in pocket? Uh... Seagull eat fish, but fish belongs to Mafia. We punch Seagull for not respecting Mafia. Seagull say, no punch, I have child. Mafia punch Seagull with child. <laughs> <laughs> lead to Mafia. Not good. Big immigration problems. We fix this by moving to island. Now no road lead to Mafia. <laughs> Beryl dressed as old lady. It makes people scared of Mafia. Life of Mafia is good. Yesterday, Mafia... Thank you. 
Child can't enter cave, boss orders. Just don't enter cave, please.
Little girlsy thing over there? Mafia wonder if there is way to get. But Mafia no time to search for entrance if Mafia need to stare. Oh. 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 